What's up, Rams? I hope you're having a golden day. I'm your host, Morgan Bailey. And I'm Emily Nalbone. This week, Emily will be filling in for Isabella. How does it feel to be at the desk, Em? I'm super excited to be back. It's going to be a great episode. Yes, it will. We hope everyone had a great fall break. It was great to be home, but I'm happy to be back on campus with my friends. Me too. We're headed into week nine of the fall semester, which means we are a little over halfway to the end. Yes, now I'm going to start counting down the days until Thanksgiving break. But now let's get into some fun news. The Phillies are making their way to the World Series for a second year in a row. They have won two games already and only need to win two more to lock in their place in the World Series. Phillies fans are super excited. Last Wednesday, the community gathered in town to cheer on the Phillies rally bus while it traveled down the streets of Westchester. It was really looking like a red October. In other trending news, a new couple has finally made their debut, Travis Kelsey and Taylor Swift. They were seen arriving at SNL holding hands. There has been a speculation about the couple after Kelsey went on his podcast and talked about how he wanted to give Taylor a BFF bracelet at the Eras Tour, but she doesn't talk before or after her shows. Since then, Taylor has attended multiple Chiefs games, and they have been seen in public together, but SNL is what really hard-launched their relationship. I love a good celebrity love story. Now let's pass it over to Sarah to see what the weather will look like this week. Thanks guys. Happy Monday, Golden Rams. I'm Sarah Collins here to give you this week's five day weather forecast. We start the week off with a high of 57 and a low of 37 with sunny skies throughout the day. On Tuesday, we will see a high of 61 degrees with partly cloudy skies throughout the day. Headed into Tuesday night, we will reach a brisk low of 43 degrees. I'm starting to think that typical cool fall weather may be a myth as we move on to Wednesday's forecast. We reach the highest temperature of the week being 69 degrees with partly cloudy skies throughout the day. Later in the evening, we drop down to cooler temperatures, the low reaching 50 degrees. Later in the week, we will see partly cloudy skies throughout the day on Thursday. Temperatures stay around the same with the high being 68 degrees and the low being 51 degrees. Kick off the weekend on Friday, we see a mix of sunshine and clouds throughout the day. The high will be 67 degrees, while the low drops to 52 Friday night. Enjoy this week, Rams. I'm Sarah Collins, and that is all for this week's five-day weather forecast. Sending it back to the desk. Wow, it looks like it's going to be a beautiful week. I know we have a lot going on in sports, so let's pass it to Bryn to hear the latest. What's up, Golden Rams? I'm Bryn Guido, and this is a look at sports this week on campus. First, on Monday, October 23rd at 7 p.m., we have our Golden Rams of the women's volleyball team kicking off our week with an at-home game against Caldwell University. On Tuesday, October 24th, the field hockey team goes up against Stroudsburg University at home at 4 p.m. Get out there and support our women's teams. On Wednesday, the 25th at 2 p.m., the men's soccer team versus Millersville University at home. On Saturday the 28th, the women's soccer team competes at home against Bloomsburg at 12. And again, women's volleyball will be playing against Shippard University at 1. We have a lot of home games this week, meaning a lot of opportunities to pop out and support our Rams. Rams up, signing off, I'm Bryn Guido. Looks like our teams are doing great this year. It's time to hear from our Rams about what's going on around campus. All right, so what are you expecting with this upcoming home game against Lander? Um, honestly, it's going to be tough. It's going to be our last home game um, for playoffs. Um, I think it's an equal match. You know, Lander is definitely bigger, um, but we're stronger and faster than them. And honestly, that's a huge advantage that we have, and they don't. All right, and then looking forward, you're going to have a game against Penn State. Are you even thinking about that yet? Um, yes, I am, to be honest. Um, every game that we have in the fall season, I think about. Um, I think that every game that we've had in the past builds up to the Penn State game, because obviously Penn State is going to be a tough match. It's going to be a tough game day, but I think we're ready. All right. And recently, Westchester had a hard loss against AIC. How do you think that loss is going to fuel the team going into this Saturday? We're mad. We're angry. Um, you know, we want revenge against AIC, against, honestly, all teams. Um, obviously, our hope, our mindset is to come out strong, come out hard, and win, and that's not going to happen every weekend, but based on what happened last match, we're ready. We're upset. We want to win. All right, thank you. Those are all the questions I have. 
Our Rams really know how to have fun. They really do. Well, guys, that's the end of this episode. Time flies when you're having fun. It sure does. Be sure to keep up with us on Instagram at wcu.weekly to stay up to date with our latest. I'm Morgan Bailey. And I'm Emily Nalbone. Have a great week, everyone.